Welcome, Dr. Osman. Thank you so much for joining us today. We're going to ask you a few COVID-19 questions that have come from our Asian Resource Centre members and also from La Croix and BME Forum members. Uh, my name is Dr. Uh, Osman Najam. I'm a cardiology doctor and I work in London. Uh, I've been a doctor for more than 10 years. I would like to take this opportunity to give the right information and make sure the public make a very informed decision with regards to COVID and vaccinations. So our first question is, some of our Asian households have more than one generation living under the same roof. How does this affect how the NH NHS will pr prioritize who takes the vaccine? We completely understand that a lot of the households, Asian households, for instance, uh, may be living uh, with more than one generation. So the short answer is we have started enrolling through with the phase one in UK where residents in the care home and their carers have been vaccinated or are being vaccinated. Following on from that, people over the age of 80, then 75 and 70. So what that means is if you're living in a big household, if you have someone over the age of 80 or fits in with the other groups, they will be prioritized. Um, but the people who are younger than them, just because they live with them, will not get priority. So we have to ensure that we still maintain the same measures that we're taking for COVID. Just for people to be really clear, so can a whole household be vaccinated or is it always just the elders first, even if someone has coronavirus or um, any other symptoms? No, unfortunately, no, the whole household cannot be vaccinated together just because they are living together. The plan at the moment is from January until mid-February that care home residents, carers, people over the age of 80, frontline workers, social care workers, and also people between 70 to 80 would be vaccinated. If in that household there's someone living under the age of 70, we would anticipate that they would start getting notified from end February onwards. And the target would be that by mid-February, about 15 million people would be vaccinated.